question would take actually would be very disappointed to 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 know that uh, his method is in a certain way restricted to treatment of mild conditions like asthma, snoring, uh, with things I, I saw on the internet. Uh, it's quite disappointing even for me. But you know what? When I trained practitioners in uh, Australia, I remember that I offered like sort of advanced courses, whatever, like after you can treat asthma, we can learn how to treat uh, emphysema or diabetes or chronic fatigue or, or more and more serious, you know, systemic disorders. And I did not get much interest back. Actually, practitioners themselves told me, oh, oh yeah, it's, it's plenty of asthma in, in Australia, so we're happy with what we've got. So even I, I was disappointed, and still disappointed, not to speak of Professor Buteyka. A good Buteyka practitioner does not care much how disease is called, whether it's called multiple sclerosis, or cancer, or blocked nose, or snoring, because the idea is that we treat only one disease anyway, disease which is called hyperventilation. And of course, some conditions should be taken into account and some medications should be sorted out and explanations should be given. But basically, the take method is, again, it's not an instruction how to treat, say, multiple sclerosis and uh, how to treat asthma or blocked nose. It is a rather skill to, to deal with hyperventilation, considering the condition different. Certainly, that such conditions like asthma, for example, and emphysema are very different. And uh, practitioners who qualified and who successful in treatment of asthma may not necessarily succeed in treatment of emphysema, not to speak of uh, diabetes, for example, or cancer, or any systemic disorder, actually. Well, to, to put it straight, they should have certain experience in treatment of uh, <laughs> difficult diseases. They, they, they have to know what disease is, what the uh, possible results from day one, day two, what the possible cases and reactions. Mm. Only through the practice, we've seen cases and cases and discussing it with the, well, your trainer. And that's how you get experience. You, you can't get manual how to treat even asthma, because asthma is so much different.